18th of March 2012 went down in the history of Kilmarnock Football Club as we defeated Celtic against all odds to win the League Cup. 11 players started that match in yellow, but none of them are with us anymore. So where are they now? Let's find out. After leaving Kilmarnock in the summer of 2013, Cammy Bell moved to Rangers and was their first choice goalkeeper as they won the League One title. He was at the centre of Rangers' bid for championship promotion the following season, but a poor showing in the playoffs against Motherwell consigned the Glasgow side to another season in the second tier. Bell signed for Dundee United in 2016 and left a year later, having made 35 appearances. He rejoined Kelly, signing a two-year contract, but left the following January without making a first-team appearance. The goalie has played short spells for a succession of clubs since then, with Hibbs, Partick Thistle, St Johnson and Falkirk acquiring his services. Most recently, Bell signed with League Two club Queen's Park in February 2020. After making over 400 appearances for Kelly, the midfield veteran was released in the summer of 2014, having spent his last few months at the club on loan at Cowdenbeath. He joined Queen of the South as a player coach, before becoming permanent manager a few months later. Fowler won 30 out of his 76 games in charge in Dumfries, before spending three months as player coach at Stirling Albion. He left to become assistant manager under Jack Ross at St Mirren, where they enjoyed success together. In May 2018, the pair were appointed at League One Sunderland, however they failed to get promotion in their first season. When things did not work out down south, Fowler was appointed as Kelly's Head of Football Operations in November 2019, with responsibility for recruitment and scouting. Since departing Rugby Park in the summer of 2013, Sissoko has played for a number of clubs across Europe and beyond. These include Varia in the Greek Super League, Hapoel Acre in the Israeli Premier League and Kabuk Spor in Turkey. He currently plays for Finnish Premier Division side ROPS who play their games inside the Arctic Circle. His team lost to Aberdeen in the first round of Europa League qualifying last year. The Admiral left Kelly in January 2013, moving to Bradford City on an 18-month contract. He was an unused substitute as Bradford won promotion to League One in the playoff final. He returned to Scotland in August 2013 after signing a two-year deal with Hibs. He played 35 times before terminating his contract by mutual agreement. Nelson then went on to play for a number of English lower league clubs including Cambridge United, Barnet, Chesterfield and Gateshead. He is now the player manager of Blythe Spartans, replacing none other than former Kelly boss Lee Clark. Following the conclusion of his loan spell at Kelly, Ben returned to Chelsea and was then sent to Birmingham City, making just one appearance at St Andrews. He spent a brief period at Yeovil Town before returning to Scotland with Ross County, making 28 appearances for the Staggies. He had a brief spell at Colchester United before moving down into the lower league pyramid, playing with a number of clubs including Woking and Boston United. He currently plays with Matlock Town, who play in the Northern Premier League. After making 100 appearances for Kelly, the midfielder left in January 2013 and signed for Bristol City who were managed at the time by Derek McInnes. Injury hampered his time there and he signed for Oldham Athletic in June 2014, linking up with former teammate turned manager Lee Johnson who got the assist in the final. He was appointed club captain and played 78 games for the Owls before moving to Leighton Orient for an undisclosed fee. He played 21 times for Orient but was also given a 6 game ban for pushing a ball boy. He signed for Coventry City in 2017 and so far has played 90 times for the club. Although Bouge only played 20 minutes of the final, he is still worthy of inclusion in this list. After leaving Rugby Park, the midfielder played for Sparta Rotterdam and Kazakin in the third tier of Dutch football. He went on to manage the team for 72 games, winning over half of these, before becoming manager of Eredivisie side Groningen in 2018, where he won 25 of his 65 games in charge. After leaving Rugby Park, the midfielder had brief spells at Dundee and St Mirren, before going out on loan to Oldham, joining Liam Kelly and Lee Johnson at the Owls. He returned to Scotland for his third spell with Dundee, playing 56 times and scoring 8 goals. In 2016, he joined Air United as a player coach before spells in the lower leagues with Morton, Queen of the South and Partick Thistle. In February, he signed a contract with League Two side Stenhouse Muir. Hookie was released by Kelly in June 2013 after playing 337 games for the club. He briefly joined Airdrie and played four games, with his last as a professional footballer coming against Air United at Somerset Park. Since then, he has had a full-time role with the SFA 
but still retains his Killy roots. Following the 2012 season, Shields joined Rangers in the 3rd division and played 90 times for the club, helping them reach the Premiership with 19 goals. In August 2016, he joined Dundalk in Ireland, but left just 6 months later to sign for FC Edmonton in Canada. The midfielder returned to Scotland with Dunfermline, where he played 25 times. He then reunited with his father at Derry City, where he played just 10 times before joining Coleraine. His contract there was terminated in August last year, and he has yet to find another club. The striker left Rugby Park in 2013, having scored 20 goals in 56 games for the club. He moved to the capital to join Hibs on a two-year deal, but was hampered by injury and only managed five goals in 30 appearances. He joined Dundee briefly in 2015, but was released having made just seven appearances. He had brief spells at Queen of the South in Dumbarton before retiring in 2016. After having his contract terminated by Kelly in 2013, Shields unsuccessfully interviewed for their manager's job at Inverness before being appointed at Morton. He resigned in May 2014 following a 10-2 defeat to Hamilton, after Morton were already relegated from the championship. He had brief spells as boss of Terrell Sasana in Thailand before being appointed as manager of Derry City in November 2015. He won the League of Ireland Cup in 2018, however he was sacked by the club after winning 51 of his 111 games in charge. He has been manager of the Northern Ireland women's national team since May 2019. This video would not be complete without a special mention for cup hero Dieter van Turnhout. The forward left Kelly in July 2012 and two weeks later signed for Antwerp. He scored 8 goals in 25 appearances for the club but was released and joined fellow 2nd division side KSV Rosselaer on loan in August 2013. After a brief spell as the under-21s manager at Club Bruges, he was hired by KV Mechelen as part of their technical staff. He also plays for SK Berlayer alongside his coaching role.